Up here at 7,000 feet in Flagstaff, and there's plenty of inspiration for an artist such as myself. For today's adventure, I'm going to be painting one of my favorite golf courses in northern Arizona, Oak Creek Country Club in Sedona. We'll head out of town on the famous Route 66 and then drop into beautiful Oak Creek Canyon. Today uh, we're going to be working with gouache and watercolor, which uh, are very related. Watercolor is transparent and gouache is opaque, but they're both water-based and uh, really fun to work with. Oak Creek Canyon is one of my favorite places in the world and probably the last thing people imagine when they think of Arizona. It's a gorgeous creek with a ton of little swimming holes to jump in and a windy two-laner that takes you right to my favorite coffee shop in Oak Creek. We're going to stop here at Garland's for a quick cappuccino before we hit one of Sedona's most popular hikes, a quick run up Cathedral Rock. Welcome to the top of Cathedral Rock. Every time I come here, I remember bringing my three-year-old daughter up here. She was running past all the terrified adults who were afraid of heights. Uh, one thing about Northern Arizona, there's plenty of places to go uh, when you need to find some perspective. This is definitely one of my favorites. Uh, what do you love about Oak Creek in terms of the golf course here? Uh, the golf course is a Robert Trent Jones senior and junior design. Oh, junior too. Mm -hmm. That's he, unusual. Yeah, he had his hand in it. And uh, the course isn't long. Um, it's tree-lined fairways. And there's some strategy, both draw and fade mm -hmm. to the golf course. Bunkers are placed in perfect spots. We just held a mini tour tournament and had the had the big guys up here. Nice. Right? A couple of PGA Tour guys. So just just perfect place for for all golfers are there any sort of backstories or, or, or more subtle details that you might enlighten us with you know um, this is very traditional golf course what you were saying um, a very tree lined you'll feel like you're in the Midwest um, it, it's fantastic but everything breaks away from those red rocks when you're on the green, you feel like it might go towards the red rocks, but nothing does. I generally, you know, try to identify the, the main focus. You know, sometimes, especially when you're laying out the picture at the beginning, it's a lot of sort of plotting around, trying to get your scale and proportions right, you know, so. Probably best known for the posters I do each year for golf's major championships, but this is another part of my job that I truly love. There's nothing like getting out in the field and trying to capture the moment. The light's kind of fading on us a little bit, so the scene's changing a lot. I think we're going to wrap this up for now in terms of the outside session. Um, I got the whole painting blocked in. I got my basic color choices made, so it should be a short order for me to finish this up in the studio. Okay, here we are with the finished piece. I did about 70% of this uh, on the ground in Sedona on Friday and just put the finishing touches on it here in the studio on Monday morning. I'm thrilled with how it came out. Uh, this kind of work is a lot of fun for me and I'm looking to do a lot more of it this season. <laughs>